Hi everybody, welcome back to another YouTube video. My name is Maggie, if you're new to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be talking about how I cleared my skin. And I've been wanting to do this video for a really long time because I was once at a point about a year and a half ago where my skin was so bad. I had very bad cystic acne all right here on my face, like all on my cheeks, my chin. And it was honestly debilitating. It made me feel so self-conscious and I felt like I tried everything I could and nothing was working and it got super frustrating and I felt very low, like it was one of the lowest points in my adult life this far. So anyway, I wanted to share with you guys my routine, how I cleared my skin, give you guys all the tips and stuff like that so I can have it like all in one video for you to reference. I'm about to do my morning skincare routine and I've been wanting to film this for a while, like I said. So I was like, wait, I might as well just film it in real time and show you guys what I do in the morning and then I'll explain my nighttime routine and we'll go from there. So I'm just putting my hair back right now, obviously getting it out of my face so I can wash my face. Every single morning I use the Jan Marini Benzoyl Peroxide Acne Treatment Wash and this is a 2.5% benzoyl peroxide. I use this on my skin when it's dry. So I don't wash my face in the shower in the morning. I use a washcloth and I take like this much product, which I feel like that's kind of a lot. And I just will lather it into my skin. I also wanted to make sure before I shared how I cleared my skin that I got to a point where I felt like I had managed it. Like honestly, I haven't had any like acne or anything like that since I started this routine. I wanted to make sure that my skin was clear and it had stayed clear so I could honestly tell you guys about the products and the fact that they actually really work. So that's why it's kind of taken me a little bit to share this with you guys. And if you keep up with my vlogs, I have shared these products a lot over the past year and a half or so. I started my acne clearing journey in February of 2023. I'm just using a lukewarm washcloth now to remove all of the cleanser from my skin. So anyway, I started my acne clearing journey February of 2023. And like I said, I was at my lowest point with my skin. I felt so self-conscious and insecure especially with YouTube being my full-time job. I just felt like I'd never wanted to be on camera. I never wanted to film because of the way my skin looked. I didn't even want to wear makeup because I felt like it just honestly was not helping at all. So I really didn't know where to turn or what to do until I found a online esthetician. I forget, honestly, I don't remember how I found her content but her name is Tessa and she literally changed my life. She is the sweetest person ever. She lives in California and she is a acne specialist. Everything is virtual. So I booked a consultation with her in February on Zoom and we hopped on the call. We talked about my skin. I sent her before photos, videos, everything. And then we went through it all. She gave me the exact routine that I use and I have been using it ever since and my skin has cleared up and is perfect now. So I owe it all to Tessa. If you are struggling with your skin, definitely reach out to her because she will help you so much and she will help you find a routine that works for you. And this is what works for me. And after I cleanse my skin, I am going in with the Regeneration Booster from Jan Marini. I just do a couple pumps of this serum. And then after, I go in with the Siesta Face Serum, which this is a vitamin C. I love this product so much. It really has helped lighten and brighten all of like the dark spots that I had from previous acne. Final step is moisturizer, Jan Marini Hyla 3D Face Cream. This is a hyaluronic acid complex. Couldn't get that open for a sec. And I love this moisturizer so much. I use it during the winter and the summer and it's my favorite. I also use a Jan Marini sunscreen, but 
I don't have that with me right now. It's downstairs. I have the tinted one and also a non-tinted one, which I will link them down below for you guys. I love, obviously, as you guys can tell, Jan Marini products. So I like to like keep things in the family and use all the same stuff. Okay, so going into my nighttime skincare routine, I cleanse with, I have a two-step duo, like a double cleanse. And this is by Free Skin by Tessa. So Tessa has her own line of cleansers and I love these cleansers so much. Again, I've been using them since February, 2023. This is the number one, the Undo. It's a soothing makeup dissolving pre-cleanse. So this is a, I'll show you guys a little bit of my hand. It comes out like that. And it's a very creamy makeup remover and this is gonna be your first cleanse. So I like to cleanse my skin with the pre-cleanse and then I use a washcloth and I take up all makeup takes off like literally everything, dirt, all the stuff that builds up your on your skin during the day. I think it's super important to double cleanse at night. And then I go in with the low foam, which is a gentle no soap cleansing gel. And this product is clear, it gets super foamy. It doesn't strip your skin. It's never gonna feel dry. Like you're not gonna have that feeling where you get out of the shower and you're like, I need to put moisture on my skin right now. It's like tight and like, it feels like it's gonna crack. You do not get that feeling. They're super hydrating. I love these cleansers and yeah. After I get out of the shower, my nighttime skincare routine is super simple. I just use one product. This is the Age Intervention Duality. It's a benzoyl peroxide 10% adult acne treatment cream and anti-aging complex. So it has a little double Thing. So I just do one pump of each, mix that together, apply it to my face, and then of course, followed by the Hyla 3D face cream. I also have the benzoyl peroxide acne treatment lotion. This is a 5%. I will use this if I feel like my skin needs something a little bit extra. This is a really great spot treatment even, like to put on during the day if I have like one pimple where I'm like, I need to get rid of this. I will put this on also from working out. Sometimes I get like breakouts on my shoulders in my back and I like to put this on at nighttime as well. Like before bed, I'll just like put some on, which I literally had gone now. I literally had a breakout on my back from working out and went away overnight. So this stuff is amazing. Also, it's okay to like put over your whole entire face if you feel like you just need a little something extra. Love this so much. And I have two products that I just wanted to share. I don't really do any like extra things to my skin. Like this is what I use. These are the products that I have been using daily. And I will add in a mask if I feel like I want to, you know, treat myself and have like a little mask night. This is the Jan Marini Luminate face mask. And this mask really helps brighten up your skin. Like all of the spots that I had from previous acne helped, this helped lighten them so much. And I love this mask so, so much. I also like the, I don't have any left, but it's like a sheet mask that I have that is by this brand right here, Hydrinity. And they're very hydrating. I ran out of those, so <laughs> sorry. I can't show you guys. But this product right here, last but not least, is Hyacin Active Purifying Mist by Hydrinity. And this product, I'm just gonna read to you guys on the back what it is. Luxurious, lightweight, microbiome friendly treatment spray that helps to balance the skin's pH to minimize the, or to maximize the effectiveness of serums, support the skin's repair process, and boost its overall appearance. After cleansing, apply two to four pumps directly to the face and neck, allow to dry, then follow a serum. So usually I do this, I forgot to do it before I did my skincare. I'm just gonna do a little bit right now. But this stuff is perfect for after you cleanse your skin. I honestly do it morning and night before I put my products on and I have one in my bag as well. So I spritz my face after a workout, like Pilates or whatever. I'll just 
before I go home and wash my face because it just helps you know purify it and I'm not gonna say it helps like reduce or like it helps so you like don't I don't know I Tessa told me to do it after I work out so that's what I do I keep one in my bag and I keep one in my bathroom <laughs> so anyway also last but not least a really important product that is not a skincare product that I used was the clear stem mind body skin supplement I'll put a photo right here. I don't have any of them on me right now. I haven't taken this product in a year. I stopped taking it August 2023, so last August, but I took it from February to August and it is a supplement that literally helps clear your skin. I love it so much. I listened to the Skinny Confidential podcast with the Clear Stem, the people who own the company, the two owners. And it was such a great episode. I listened to it like last summer or something and I highly recommend checking it out if you want to learn more. But that supplement changed my life. Not sponsored, you can use my code Maggie McDonald to get 15% off of your order if you guys want to try it out. I love that product so much and everything that I use, everything I showed you guys in this video, I love and have been using ever since and I really I'm just so happy with my skin and it's so clear now. Sorry if the lighting was like really bad. I feel like I should have filmed <laughs> this video in different lighting. Let me open up my... <gasps> yeah, I should have filmed this video in different lighting. But anyway, this is my skin now. And I'll put my before photo right here so you guys can see what it looks like. But Basically, if you are feeling like you are at a point in your life where your skin is very bad and you don't know what to do and you feel like it's never gonna get better, I promise you it will. I know how hard it is and I know how awful it can make you feel. But just remember you are beautiful with or without acne and acne doesn't define who you are as a person in your worth and it does get better. Trust me, you just have to believe and don't give up on trying. Definitely reach out to Tessa if you feel like you're at a place where you just don't know where to turn. Book a consultation with her because she is so amazing and she will help you so, so much. So yeah. Also take photos. Remember to take photos every single month to track your progress because it might not seem like you have improved at all, but trust me when you look back at photos, like even if your skin is at its worst, I remember the first photo I ever took, I was like, oh my God, I don't even want to take the photo with my front camera because it is so bad. You will regret not taking the pictures and you'll be glad that you had them so you can compare. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope that it was helpful and sending all my love to you if you are struggling with your skin, struggling with any acne. It does get better, I promise you. And just try to stay positive. I know how hard it is, but... It will get better. I love you. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys.